today and if you're not feeling well I hope you feel better very soon. I'm still feeling a bit ropey after my vaccinations but you know it'll wear off I'm sure. I've got my gorgeous Georgiana with me today my little <laughs> shy girl she's sucking her thumb again every time I bring her on she's sucking her thumb isn't she? She's the Yowl Sculpt by Gudrun Legler and she is a partial silicone which means that her head, arms and legs are silicone and her body is a doe suede body. And she's snuggling with her little bunny. She loves this bunny. <laughs> right, we're going to change her today uh, to keep in with my theme. Um, we're going to change her into this absolutely beautiful knitted romper it's stunning absolutely stunning i love it and it's my favorite color of pink which is dusky pink uh what's the make on this uh, can i see i can't see what it is but anyway it's absolutely beautiful and it's this lovely finely knitted dusky pink romper and it's got a pattern across the front where they've done They've knitted it in pearl and, uh, pearl and plain. And then there's a little th threaded bow in the middle. Really, really cute. And it's got this big, deep, broidery, anglais, white collar on it. And short sleeves. So, to go with that, I've got a pair of knitted shoes exactly the same colour dusky pink um, and they've got like a little t-bar and a little bow on the front of them just like the romper has and some little socks with broidery ombre on to match the collar so that's what we're going to be putting her in for my pink for girls section so let's just Oh, my little dog's scratching on the door, so I'll get her in. Yeah, well, sweetie. <laughs> There's a good girl. I thought she was out in the garden with her dad, but she must have come in and wondered where I was. She's like my little shadow. If she's not with me, she wants to know where I am, <laughs> which is nice. So yeah, still feeling a bit ropey, but um, like I say, it's going to wear off. So it's just a case of not doing too much really, isn't it? And taking care of yourself. Right, over you go, darling. Oh, she's so sweet, this little one. Um, yeah, just taking it easy, really. See if I can get these buttons undone. There we go, that's the first one. This is a pretty little dress that I got off of eBay. This little mayoral one. Look how she's crossed her feet over. You see, she's got a little hill prick, which I asked Alexandra to do, but look, she's done that naturally. She's just crossed her little feet over. There we go. This is a gorgeous kit, I love it. I love the facial expression on her, you know. She's so quizzic, quizzical at the world, you know. What's going on? What's this about? <laughs> Bless her, she's so cute. And of course, she comes in a vinyl version as well. And she wants to say hi to all her sisters out there. There's a few in the community. Let's just undo this. Yeah, I love pink. I've always loved pink. And when I was a little girl, my mum always used to um, buy all their clothes at what we in the UK call jumble sales, which is where 
you know, churches and everything used to do them and people donated clothes. So all our clothes were second hand when I was a child. Didn't have anything new, you know. And um, you just got to put your arms up, sweetheart. Can you put them up for mummy? No, she said, I don't want to. Let's just pull it up a bit more. There we go. Um, and I always wanted to have pink things. And when my eldest brother got married to a lovely, lovely lady, she was a brilliant sewer. And she used to make us dresses and she always made a pink dress and a blue dress for me and my younger sister. And my younger sister always used to get the pink dress. Oh, that fits her lovely, look at that. So cute. And I always used to say to my mum, you know, why, why can't I have the pink dress? I'd like to have the pink dress. I like pink. And she used to say to me that, well, she only said it the once, she said, your sister is prettier than you, and she looks nicer in pink than you do. <laughs> it's not very nice, is it? Um, and um, so I always get got the blue dresses. So now I like to buy myself, you know, a lot of pink things. And when I was a teenager, I used to get myself pink things. I think part of the problem was I was always kind of there we go sweetie oh <laughs> she's all beautiful that fits her nicely doesn't it look at that um I was always very big boned I've always been you know big boned and um my sister was quite dainty you know uh she was premature when she was born and it took her till like her teenage years before she really started getting more you know bigger bones and everything so you know she was very dainty whereas I wasn't so she obviously looked like you know those Pink was better on her than me, but oh, I did like pink. I've always liked it. There we go. Get her knitted shoes on. <laughs> Little Amber's been out for a walk and she's been fixated on the fact there was a dead mouse on the side of the road and she obviously been caught by a cat and she wanted to get to this mouse so my husband brought her back home because he didn't want her picking it up obviously oh they fit her lovely i was worried they'd be a bit big but they're fine i'll give her hair a brush and then i'll show you what she looks like my gorgeous ginger girl. Yeah, it's quite a nice day here today again. We had rain first thing this morning, but um, it seems to be blown over now. And we've got quite nice weather, but it's chilly, you know, obviously it's autumn. There she is. So what do you think of her in that? Look at this. Oh, she's so cute. She's so cute. And that, that looked pretty on her. And her little shoes and the socks. She's a beautiful girl. What are you up to, young lady? Amber's having a little sniff round. <laughs> so there she is for my Pink for girls. She's going to hold on to her bunny. <laughs> She's a beautiful girl. So I hope you enjoyed seeing her today. And uh, yeah, and uh, thank you to those that have already joined in. I've put some pictures 
at the front of some of my friend's babies for you. Um, yeah, so enjoy those and hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll see you tomorrow. Mwah! Love you ladies and gentlemen, you're special.